What's going to happen with these children tomorrow? They are going to grow up with this and they are going to revenge. Which means we have a lot of work to do. You know, Dr. Yak is a tribal man. I can tell from. If you are defeated politically, don't attempt to mobilize your people. You are killing them for nothing. If they want to support Victoria, let them support through politically, not by war. Now everybody is saying that this is a, a tribal war. And it, it, according to me, it is not a tribal war. It is a political, a political struggle. Me now, in my home here, I'm staying with another guy now. Why not? I, I, I will not kill him. If it is tribal war. To transform the society and to make these tribal identities less uh, problematic in terms of creating social cohesion, you will need to create a, a middle class or a working class. People who care mainly about economic issues and economic policies and about stability. And so that when somebody wants to instigate war, they know that they own a property, they work, and they, and they will lose something. They will care less about their tribal affiliation. They will care more about things that will keep the nation stable. So there is a need to reconcile the people of South Sudan and then begin a complete transformation of the society so that their tribal identities become these good things, ancestral things, but they are no longer exploited for political reasons. And, and once you do that, then you will have a stable and a beautiful South Sudan.